Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can transfer files from your Samsung phone to your Mac computer. Okay, so this doesn't matter if you have a Mac laptop or a Mac iMac, this will work. So the first thing we're going to need is a piece of software because if you connect your Samsung phone directly into your Mac, there's no way to get the files off without this piece of software. And you will need the cable for this to work. So I'm gonna open up Google and in the search bar, you just want to type Samsung Smart Switch. And I'll leave the link for that in the description down below. So you, I'll just find it really quickly. You're looking for Samsung Smart Switch, this link right here. It'll be linked up in the description down below. Okay, so once you come to the Samsung Smart Switch page, you wanna choose here download on the Mac App Store. You just click on that link and it will download it onto your computer. And then what you need to do is you need to install that file onto your Mac computer. If you don't know how to install a file on a Mac computer, then there are various videos on YouTube that will show you that process, but it is straightforward. Then when you have that app installed on your Mac, you can go and open it up. So let me minimize that and I'll open up Smart Switch from my dock. So what it says, welcome to Smart Switch. All you will need to do is, and in the installation process, it's very important that you set the correct permissions. You want to give the app the permissions that it tells you and it walks you through it in the setup process. But what I'll do now is I'll use the cable of my phone and I'll plug in my Samsung phone. And as you can hear, it just connected and you actually have to unlock your phone for this to work. So I'll unlock my phone. It says connecting to your device. That will just take a moment to read your files. And then on your phone, it should say get connected. And you can see here Stevens S21. Now you can see a drop down arrow next to that. Click on that drop down arrow and you can click on this little open file browser icon. And this will show you all your different files on your phone. So if I, for example, want to go to my photos, I just go to the DCIM folder. You can see here's my videos and my photos. If I want my screen recordings, I can click on that one and that will load up all my files. Then you can just simply drag and drop it. Let's just say onto your desktop for an example. And it is quite fast using the cable. And here you can see the file on my desktop right over there. And that's all you need to do. So if this video helped you out, don't forget to drop a like onto this video and subscribe for more. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care.